Hi, and welcome to uh, this Wednesday's vlog. I'm going to change it to a weekly vlog. I'll try and get it on every Wednesday for you. Um, so I hope you're all keeping well since last the last vlog. I think it was last week. Um, I think it was last Wednesday, <laughs> I think. But um, God, the days go so quick. But um, yeah, just a short one. I had um, a guy called Michael on the podcast the other day, Michael Gigax, if you have a chance to check that one out. It's a really good episode. He talks about running and he's a trainer actually. Of um, he, he, He's a coach, rather, a running coach. And he, he, he just gave some really good advice for motivating people who run and all kinds of sports. Like um, I thought I wanted to share with you guys. Um, basically, he says that, just say, for instance, you're doing really well at a, a particular distance, let's say um, 400 meters or, or 800 meters, but you could kind of stick at that, what you're good at, because if you're good at something, you only, can only improve. Um, so like, there's no point if you're, if, if you're kind of slowish at a half marathon or, or like um, if, if you're kind of doing well at a particular distance, be it a bit short or even a, a 5K, or a ten k, and you're you you're maintaining a good good um good time. Well, if you're interested in getting a good time, that is, it's good to kind of concentrate on um what you're good at, and that will motivate you and bring you forward. You know, so I think that's really really good good advice that Michael gave to the night. Um, you should check out the podcast. It's on Anchor, and it's also on Podbean. Being now another another platform, I decided to put my podcast on. But um, yeah. So listen, I hope you're enjoying these short vlogs. Um. Yeah, so um, what I might do for you tonight is um, a well-known Irish song. Um, I'll just show you the chords. It's very, very easy. It's great beginners, uh, great for beginners. So I'll bring the, the, the screen down. So all it is is D, okay? And then A. Well, it's A, kind of A7. Like, it's just, um, it's the, the fourth string down. And the second fret, and then the um, sorry, no. yeah, sorry, it's the um, it's a third string down, so that's the D string, and then the B string. That's that's what you're holding down. So it's the um, so it's the third string, which is the B string, and then the fifth string, which is the B string. That's the A chord. Okay, it's an A chord. I call it A. So that's all it is, all the way through the song. It's 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 really simple, great for beginners. So um, I'll just just show it to you how it goes. Uh, do a short bar of it. So again, it's just D, then A, could be any simpler. I love these simple songs. They're great. <laughs> so it's Molly Malone, um, Molly Malone, and this is a little bar of it. Okay, here we go. Dublin's first city Where the girls are so pretty I first set my eyes on Sweet Molly Malone She wheeled a wheelbarrow Through the streets broad and narrow Crying cockles and muscles Alive, alive, oh. Chorus. Alive, alive, oh. Alive, alive, oh. Crying cockles and muscles. Alive, alive, oh. One more verse, and they hear it. So hold with D for a minute. She was a fishmonger and sure was no one for so were her father and mother before. They both wheeled their barrows through the streets broad and narrow, crying cockles and muscles. Alive, alive, oh. Alive, alive, oh. Alive, alive, oh. Crying cockles and muscles. Alive, alive, oh. Alive, alive, oh. Crying cockles and muscles. Alive, alive, oh. Alive, alive, oh. Crying cockles and muscles. Alive, alive,
live on Playing cockles and muscles Alive, alive on Yeah, so that was um, Molly Malone, a well-known Dublin song. <laughs> but uh, back again for you. Yeah, so um, very simple. It's just D or um, you can just do the normal A as well, which is um, which is just um, the three strings. Um, the sorry, the the D string, uh, the G and the B on the second fret. That's that's A. So you can do that as well, or you can just miss the. Um, miss the G string and just play the um, D and the B. That's the way it's played, okay? So I um, hope you enjoyed that, that short little lesson about Money Malone. <laughs> um, and um, if you are liking them, uh, you might um, subscribe to my channel. And um, once again, if you could just leave a, a short comment of what motivates you, um, that would be amazing just to help other people. Um, people... Uh, yeah, uh, follow you and try and get get what, what you're getting as well. But um, more like doing what you're doing and getting motivated. That's what I meant. Sorry. Um, yeah. So listen. Until next Wednesday. Uh, thanks a lot for listening and take good care of yourselves. Thank you. Bye. Oh yeah. Sorry. Just one other thing. Um, just to recap what I what I what I um talked about a few minutes ago. Um, wanted to start to, to vlog off. It was basically just um to let you know that. What Michael said, which is really good advice, if you're good at a particular distance, let's say running, um, and you're good at a 5K or um, 400 meters or 800 meters, stick at that. And because you're good at it, it's gonna motivate you to improve. And every time you do it, just trying to get a bit quicker to so being a stopwatch or uh, on your phone or on your on your, on your uh, watch, a stopwatch um, or in, on most phones. So. That's a good way to improve. Okay, listen, till next time, take good care of yourselves and see you. See you then. See you Wednesday.